Harry Redknapp was just four years old the last time Portsmouth won at Liverpool in 1951. They've never visited since in more confident mood than today after six successive away Premier League wins. Well, the mood is rather different in the Liverpool camp after back-to-back -back defeats, but Rafa Benitez saw enough in last Sunday's loss to Manchester United to name the same team today. Only Arbeloa and Carragher played in the Carling Cup at Chelsea in midweek. There is one enforced change for Portsmouth. Herman Ryderson in for the injured no Pamero in a team led by Saul Campbell, who makes his 50th appearance for Pompey at the end of a week in which he's spoken out against abuse towards players from fans. Expect polite banter from the Anfield crowd here. Carragher, Torres. Played back to Torres by Benayoun. Torres tries to get away from Distan, and Dirk Kout surely thought he was going to score. Out came David James to get in his way. Glenn Johnson playing his part too, and hurt in the process. Distan tried to tug back Torres, good job he didn't. Great challenge by Johnson, actually. Joe Jordan, looking at notes and talking to Harry Redknapp, who's got Lauren ready. But they're going to take a chance on Johnson being able to continue, at least for now. Kuehl to Torres. Campbell anxious to keep him outside the area, but he can't, and Torres twists and turns his way in towards the edge of the six-yard box. Back into Benayoun! <laughs> Sully Montari lost his way in midfield. Campbell just didn't fancy the idea of Fernando Torres running at him. Twisted past him at first. The ball played back in by Harry Kuehl, and he picked out Benayoun beautifully. The crisp volley by the Israeli international gives Liverpool the lead. And if there was any pressure, it's just eased a little. And then Johnson. And he's got back onto the field. Torres ran down his wing to make his way into the area. It subsequently led to the Liverpool goal. Montari. Cut out by Mascherano. And this is Dirk Kout. Torres in the centre. He's being watched by Campbell. Torres managed to hold him off, but it's an own goal. <laughs> Liverpool will take the lucky breaks however they may come. Ball given away by Montari. Kout on the run. Well, Campbell thought he'd done enough on Torres, but plays it against his centre-back partner. This stands just coming back to help out. In the end, he's got in the way. Liverpool 2, Portsmouth 0. Harry's boys up against it, just 16 minutes played. Portsmouth yet to register anything of note at the Liverpool end. Mascherano now was caught by Papa Buba Diop and Mike Riley has come running in, blasting away on his whistle. Mascherano is there first. Well, he is completely off the floor, Buba Diop. You know what? In second viewing, he might be fortunate. Carragher. Lower, kept his balance and found Benayoun, counters in the centre, Kuehl further over, Benayoun might not need anyone. Into the side netting. Don't think it was the crispest of finishing attempts. Blackburn, Fulham, Wigan, Newcastle, Birmingham, Aston Villa. Those are the places Portsmouth have been to and won at in the Premier League in recent weeks. They are to make it seven in a row on the road. Well, they've got it all to do in this second half. It would by far and away be the most impressive victory of the lot. Unlikely though it may seem right now. Montari. Oh, trying to spin clear of Hupia. Give it away! The shot is only just over the top from Papa Buba Diop. Is it something to do with defending that end? Liverpool have caught the Pompey first half disease here. Lower with his foot in, straight to Buba Diop. Canu. 
Great ball for Benjani, disguised ball from Canu. Benjani! Portsmouth are back in the game. Don't rule them out yet. One of Harry's half time changes has done the trick. The introduction of Canu has given Portsmouth the look of having more threat about them. And what a pass that is for Benjani, who did well himself, mind you. He still had a lot to do. Canu had a look up outside of the boot, knew where he was putting that. Look at the way Benjani steps inside Risa and ends a five game goal drought by scoring to give Portsmouth a chance again. 2 1. Hoopier. This is Kewell. He's gone for it. Oh, sizzling effort. James wasn't sure. Henry Kewell put plenty behind that. It's swerving, but crucially, it wasn't dipping. Count. Chirano trying to find Barbel, might be in here. Come back to Torres! Well, that should be enough for Liverpool to claim all the points now. They have their two-goal lead back. And Barbel trying to get in between Distan and James. Again, Portsmouth a little unlucky. It's a brilliant finish, too. James doesn't really come for it convincingly. Think anything other than convincing about Torres' finish. Aurelia. Torres. Well, Campbell had a good yard head start, and Torres burned past him and wins the corner. Nothing to do with the fact that Sol's 33 now. At 23, he wouldn't have kept up with Fernando Torres. Nice bit of dancing, though. Rupi has made a dart for the near post. It's not close enough to him. Mascherano. Carragher urged to have a dick. Why not? Oh, he's found Gerard instead. Great pass. Torres! All over now. Another two for the Fernando Torres total. Seven goals in his last eight Good Liverpool appearances. Number nine, Fernando Torres. Good job Jamie Carragher didn't listen to the cop and have a dip himself. I bank on Torres to be far more accurate. Liverpool are back to winning ways in the Premier League.